What if I told you ancient civilizations discovered a technology more powerful than any modern medicine? For over 5,000 years, cultures worldwide have known breathing as more than just oxygen exchange. The ancient Indians called it prana, life force energy flowing through everything. The Chinese called it qi, Greeks called it pneuma. Same concept, different names. Modern science dismissed this as mysticism until researchers started measuring impossible feats. Yogis stopping their hearts for 17 seconds, heating their bodies in freezing temperatures. Monks reducing their metabolism by 64% while staying warm in snow. Nobel Prize winner Albert Zent Georgiai discovered the secret. It's all about electrons. The more oxygen our cells can process, the more alive we become. When cells lose this ability, we literally start rusting from the inside. That's aging and disease. Every breathing technique you've heard of traces back to these ancient practices. From Wim Hof method to yoga pranayama, they're all variations of the same core science. The Indus Valley civilization practiced breath control 5,000 years ago. Modern yoga became exercise, but original yoga was sitting still and breathing. These techniques weren't for healing problems. They were for healthy people to unlock superhuman potential. The technology has been inside us all along, waiting to be activated. One breath at a time, we can literally evolve our consciousness and extend our lives.